and that is the Labour leader, Sir Keir Starmer, uh, giving a major speech uh, this morning at the uh, Labour London conference. He outlined how a Labour government will give people, and I quote, a sense of possibility again, while focusing on the changes that he has made to the party since it lost the 2019 general election. Well, our reporter, Paul Hawkins, was listening to all of that and gleaning reaction to it as well, and I'm delighted to say that he can join us live now, as you can see. Paul. Yeah, hi, Alistair. Yeah, the, the, the general message from Sir Keir Starmer was uh, never again and the work never stops. He was effectively saying, look, we've changed. The Labour Party's changed since 2019 when they suffered that huge general election defeat, their biggest since 1935, and that they're now ready to change the country. Got a big round of applause when he talked about never again to uh, anti-Semitism and that he continues to root it out of the party, that they've come a long way since the days of Jeremy Corbyn. And another warm round of applause as well when he talked about NATO membership, unconditional NATO membership uh, as well. So uh, Sir Keir Starmer hammering home that they're also fit to run the economy and that any Labour spending, when Labour comes to power, if Labour comes to power, will have to involve what he calls sound money. That is, you can trust us with the public finance. And that would feed into the GB News People's poll that we had on Tuesday, just over a 1,000 people polled, and 32% said they would trust Labour on the economy compared to the Conservative Party, which is, you know, unheard of. Normally the economy, fertile ground for the Conservative Party, but clearly the opinion polls have shifted in that favour. Nevertheless, a word of warning from Peter Mandelson, who at the moment is giving a talk in the uh, conference room behind us titled How Labour Can Win the Election. And he started by, first of all, paying tribute to how far Sir Keir Starmer has brought the party since 2019. He then went on to say that enjoy the opinion polls in that wispish way that he talks. He said enjoy the opinion polls while they last. He said because they are like a joint. They're very relaxing but don't inhale it. 